Hey there, so I have a really, really quick a little video here for you today. And I wanted to share three traits of six figure earners because I know so many of you have that goal. And here's the truth, you're gonna be faced with challenges. So number one is decide to take ownership for your feelings, okay? This is probably one of the things that I see happen most often that takes people out of the game. And that is that people play the blame game, they act like the victim, and I think that that's kind of cultural, right? It's just part of our culture, and um, commiserating, complaining. So here's the thing, if you're going to become a six or even seven figure earner, take ownership of how you feel. Make the decision to be proactive and not reactive, okay? And I also find that writing in a journal, reflecting on where were the emotional triggers in your business today, and how will you show up better tomorrow? Because if you're going to become a six-figure earner, you have to think like a six-figure earner. You have to act like a six-figure earner. Being a six-figure earner in the way that you show up in the world creates the six-figure income. So first and foremost, take ownership of your feelings and be proactive, not reactive, okay? Number two is have a strategy for when things don't go your way because let's be honest, they don't always. <laughs> when you're an online entrepreneur, you can have all kinds of issues such as technology issues, such as, you know, uh, no internet. Like that's what happens to me often is we live in the country. Even though we're four miles from downtown, the internet there is bad. And yet, I figure out a way to make it happen. And sometimes I have to get in my car to drive to the top of the hill so that I can have the connection, so that I can do my video class or um, you know, be on a call, okay? So that was number two. Number three in becoming a six-figure earner is set yourself up with a morning routine that supports success. So rather than picking up your phone and going and and scrolling through the news feed of either Facebook or Instagram, I would love for you not to pick up your phone for the first hour of the day. Can you guys do that? I think you can. And then I would love for you to do some personal development practice, such as light a candle, grab your journal. I've started doing um, illustration style journaling, so I'll be posting the behind the scenes of that on my Instagram stories. That, for me, is a form of meditation as well. Like for something, for some reason, the drawing and then writing out of the quotes and then relating to it, that helps me to be very proactive during my day. I found for me that if I do personal development in the morning with reading inspirational books, whether that relates to sales, that relates to social media, that relates to mindset, to belief, to um, abundance thinking, if I plug into those things first and I do my journaling, my meditation, yoga, then I am set. I am ready for the day. I rock it out. So those are my three tips for you. I would love to see what you have in mind. What do you? Th how do you think a six-figure, seven-figure earner shows up in her day? What does she do? What, how does she think? What are the habits she cultivates? I would love to see that. And also, I would love for you to share this if you enjoyed it. Because I know that there are women out there who have such incredible gifts, and yet it's these little pieces that we just need to get into place to help them become the woman who creates financial freedom for her family, who changes the future and the legacy that she will leave. That's what I want for you. That's what I'm passionate about here. That's why I want to invite you to join our Heart to Heart Tribe because we're a group of women that are committed to building an online business without the drama, without the negativity, without spinning out into self-doubt and stories that aren't true. Like we're, I'm really good at helping you all envision your destination and then cultivating the habits to take you from A to B, to C, to D, and on and on and so forth. Because this really is a journey. I don't even care how successful you've been, you'll face setbacks. I know that I have in my life.
So I appreciate you all for showing up on this video today. Please share it with somebody who will love it. And um, I'm going to strip the audio and put it on my podcast. Now I have eight podcast episodes ready to launch. Who's excited for that? And um, I've got some really cool Instagram information coming out for you guys. So hopefully you'll stay, stay tuned to that. If you haven't joined the um, Heart to Heart Tribe yet, just send a private message saying you would love to be added. Um, and if you go to my profile, you can shoot me the, a DM or you can click a button that says get started and that's how you can get added. Okay. I'll talk to you guys soon. Thanks for tuning in. Have a good day.